Hi, my name is Blake McGowan and I'm a certified professional ergonomist with HumanTech. One of the areas of research that's getting a lot of focus these days is the relationship between workplace factors in a manufacturing environment and carpal tunnel syndrome or CTS. One of the things that's interesting is the prevalence of uh, CTS in the working population ranges between 2 and 21 percent. That is about four times higher than it is in the general population. In 2015, a group, a group of researchers uh, formed the NIOSH Upper Limb Consortium, which includes researchers that are very well known, such as Silverstein, Capellish, Garg, and Rempel. They pooled all their data together to understand or better understand the relationship between workplace factors in the manufacturing environment and carpal tunnel syndrome. They specifically looked at three different categories of factors, personal factors, work uh, psychology factors and biomechanical factors. So what did they find? Well, let's first start with the biomechanical factors. They found an extremely strong relationship or association between high hand forces and CTS. The, the relationship was so strong, it's almost like a dose response relationship. They also found that there was a lesser relationship between things like CTS and repetition and CTS and awkward postures. Now, with regards to the personal factors, there's three main findings related to uh, gender, related to age, as well as weight. What they found is individuals that are older or over the age of 50 have a higher association with CTS. Females are also linked with higher rates of CTS, as well as people that are categorized as being obese. So what does this mean? What's the bottom line? Well, the bottom line is for those jobs that have high hand force, we really need to focus on addressing and minimizing that risk to reduce carpal tunnel syndrome. Also, if you are, have a work environment that has a lot of females, people that are categorized as obese, or an older population, this magnifies the risk for CTS. For more information on the Bottom Line series and Human Tech, please feel free to visit us at our website. Thanks. Have a great day.